Hi everyone. Well, today I'm in one of my old stomping grounds and glad to be here. I'm actually in Swiss Cottage and I'm going to check out the um, Swiss Cottage Farmers Market. Yeah, it's a lovely day. I thought, you know what? I'm going to get out and enjoy it and do something. And uh, that's what I'm going to do. So today we're heading down to the Swiss Cottage uh, Farmers Market. See what they got. This could be interesting. Yeah, Swiss Cottage. Uh, there's no actual reason why it's called Swiss Cottage, but to the left hand side, on my left hand side, is if you're familiar with London and this side of London, northwest, is the Swiss Cottage, Swiss Cottage pub. And it's a uh, bang in the centre of all uh, the traffic around about the joining roads heading. Uh, this is the Finchley Road. Uh, if you go behind the Swiss Cottage, you're heading towards central London. And if you carry on up, you're heading towards North Finchley. Um, yeah, there's no particular reason why this area is called Swiss Cottage, but I do know that around 18, 1804, obviously before my time, um, the Swiss Cottage pub was actually a small toll cottage. And it was uh, actually called the Swiss Chalet. Uh, someone obviously didn't like that, so later on they changed it to the Swiss Cottage as it is known today. Uh, let's go and check out the farmer's market in Swiss Cottage. As I say, I haven't actually been here before, I've heard about it. And uh, well, as it's a lovely day, I'll have a little wander up here and see what it's all about local fresh seafood today that could be quite interesting considering there's no sea around here but hey ho there you go fala portuguese delicacies mm, nice love my portuguese bom dia how are you doing oh you got coxinhas you make them yourself yes portuguese sardines some Portuguese cakes and yeah nice thank you, thank you. have a nice day wow. yeah all your uh, different types of um, turkey sweets desserts olives my old mate Riff over here he actually used to be part of a famous band but I'm not going to name drop Riff if you want to try and guess which band it was leave comments below i'll tell you what it's not the biggest market in the world but certainly quite a lot going on here i've come down here with my mate riff and he's told me that i've got to try the jamaican um lamb curry oh goat curry i love goat curry anyway so it's good i'm looking forward to that lebanese street food you've also got your pad thai going on here a bit of thai food Sorry, Trey's Flavas. How you doing, Gab? All right? Trevor's not so a good cook. Can... He's a fucking good cook. So I've come here recommended that Trevor's an absolutely fantastic yeah. cook. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to be tasting some of his stuff <laughs> later Bumbastic. on. Just with uh, Mr. Bumbasket. So how you doing, Trevor? What's up? What kind of food is this? Uh, Jamaican. Jamaican. Okay, so you've got some uh, chicken jerk going on there, some rice and beans. Jerk chicken. Well, that's what I left the bit because all is going on. Oh, fantastic. Dirt chicken, you got curry goat. Oh, do you know what? Look at that. Oh, yeah. Goat curry, I'll tell you what. You, you, you can't. That's done. That's me done. I'm having some goat. I'm going to have me some goat curry. Don't go, don't go anywhere. We're coming back, all right? <laughs> so, yeah, here we got uh, Asia Hut. That's how I finish. We've got curry. Chicken curry. Curry. You've got some curry stuff going on here as well. Yeah. How are you doing? Beautiful, thank you. Some more pastries. The petite mouling. It's all happening here. It's like a potato salad. Mix. What about a mixture? Lentils. How, how, how have you separated the meat from the vegetables on this? Mix, not meat. Curry, barley, ragu. Meat? You can reveal. Look. 
gnocchi lentils, roasted carrots. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. There's no meat in there, mate. It's vegetarian. Oh. Organic raw apple juice. I was hoping that would be cider. Yeah, so a lot of apple stuff going on. Some nice ones. How are you doing, Gav? All right. I was hoping, I was hoping that would be cider. No, it went down to cider in a couple of days. Yeah, yeah, more like vinegar, I think. <laughs> My mate Riff, he's uh, he's going to opt for the vegetarian today. Why do you think this would be here? Though, you want to have some of that? It? What was it? It was five minutes. Oh, God, yeah. Sorry, sorry. Swiss Cottage Market. Open Tuesday to Saturday. 10 a.m. till 5 p.m. There you have it. Zoom in there a little bit. Swiss Cottage Market. <laughs> French man's a bit tight, isn't he? So I'm grabbing some of this curry. So Colin Trevor, what do you recommend for me then? Recommend? Oxtail with rice and peas, no, white oxtail rice. Done. Oxtail finished. Oxtail finished. Ah, the oxtail finished. Both oxtail done. Well, the, the curry goat then. For the curry, curry, curry goat. Curry goat. Curry it goat it is, mate. So we've got a vegan option here. Kalelo rice, peas with rice. Pepper steak. Have you had the pepper steak before? Yes, sir. What is that? Beef. 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 Beef.
look at that. Oh my gosh, look. Just look at that. All in a little pot. Oh. And the proof of the pudding. Uh, see what it's all about. I love coke. That true Jamaican style go curry with rice, rice, rice and black bean. Look, it's, it's got it's even got the black beans in it. But yeah, yeah delicious, absolutely delicious. Pop that. Just what you need in London. We've got some. What is that? Is that that's the um, the French one? Is it? Yeah. And what is um, it? French ragu. French ragu. And he says it's very nice. Um, radio room in there, where Margaret Thatcher was. She's there, and she's uh, saying Britain, London has been attacked. Oh, and all it, it's really oh, spooky right. in there. Oh, but but if you know the history of it, the people got it was it was built on her um, Saxon burial ground. Oh, I see. Yeah, mate. Right. A pagan. Oh, a pagan. Wow. Mate, I tell you what, it's. And a few people got killed making the place. So there is, there is do you get I me? Mean? There is some ghosts there. I know it's active. We've got to get to 30 East Drive next. Right, what's happening there? Is that in London? It's a poltergeist house. Where is that? Yeah, it's up, in, up, up north somewhere. Well, if it's at his house, he's got a poltergeist. <laughs> yeah. That'd be him. Yeah. <laughs> And after a lovely lunch, I'm going to hop into the North Star and have myself a nice refreshing pint uh, because I can. Again, one of the only pubs left in Finchley Road. Well, this side of Finchley Road, obviously you go towards North Finchley, you've got some more down that way. Finchley Road tube station, just up the road there. Cheers, mate. Oh, mate. I'll have a pint of cider, please. This is the North Star pub. They've also got... Yeah. There's also an upstanding outside. garden at the North Star, pretty busy in the summer, quite a nice view, if you like petrol stations. Well, happy days uh, to Swiss Cottage Farmers Market and North Star Pub where I am. Oh, so refreshing. Just what the doctor ordered. Thank you very much for watching. See you travels. See you on the next one. Cheers.